hello guys welcome to classic sets pro so guys in this video uh, we will <coughs> discuss that how can you recover uh, your 8k satellite receiver especially star set srx double seven so many of customer was asking us question that how can uh, they recover their device in case either the device got stuck in the boot state either due to power loss or either due to wrong software or any other reason so at first uh, we will go to the pc and see here what is the method or what are the necessary preparation we have to make in order to recover so at first you have to get a usb drive uh, which is compatible with this stb and uh, try that it should be in fat32 format and the other thing you have uh, must have a pc and then uh, you must have the latest software file for starts at srx double seven so at first we will go to the pc and make this usb ready or in such a state so that this uh, receiver can easily be recoverable so at first we will go to the stb uh, sorry to the pc so now guys i have uh, turned on my pc and uh, now i will we will prepare our usb so at first uh, we will see the step which we have to follow so step step number one is that we have to go to these other one of the website mentioned either you can go to cwdw or you can go to swdw and uh, from that website we will download our software so uh, step one is that we will have to download our software and these two are the best websites so on cwdw in left uh, section if you will scroll down you can uh, see the SRX double seven section, and uh, when you click on it, you will see the available list of software. So you can download any uh, one of them. So its file size is almost equal to one GB. So I already have downloaded this latest version of date uh, nine May two zero two five. So as you can see the size of the file and uh, what will be the next step so the next step is that so let me show you another uh, the second website which is swdw so here we will type x double seven and uh, you will again get the same software so in any case if uh, any one of them website is not working then you can use the second one so both are best and good website for downloading star set software so here the query is found and uh, you can see the same latest version software is available so uh, the second thing is that you have to download the software which i already have downloaded in order to save time and then you have to take the usb drive usb so uh, it is essential that you must have format your usb with fat32 and uh, if you use ntfs format that it, it is also good but you must use fat32 so now we will create a new folder and rename that folder name to rom update so step number four is that step number three was to create a new folder in the usb and step number four is to rename the folder with the name of rom update or capital o m and u capital b d a t e so now the folder has been created and what is the next step so in next step we will copy the latest downloaded software of star set srx double seven and place in that rom update uh, folder created in the usb so step five is to place the software into that uh, rom update folder created in the usb so here we will click right click and then click on copy and then we will open our usb and scroll into the folder rom update and in that rom update folder we will place the software so uh, the software where will take a little bit of time to be copied because it is almost of 1 gb
so now guys the software has been copied so the next step step number seven uh, sorry step number six is to rename the latest software file into rom update so i have renamed it so the step number seven is to that uh, you know usb now your usb is ready and uh, now you will power you will have to power off your stb and connect the usb to your stb and then we will follow up so guys i have made my usb prepared uh, i have created a folder and then placed uh, rename the software file and place in it so now i will connect this uh, device this usb to the receiver and make sure the receiver is in power off state as you guys can see it is in power off state so now i will uh, press and hold the power button and at the front you can see the status and now i will uh, power on the electric supply so now you here you can see it is it has gone into update mode and let's see So guys, uh, it has gone into update recovery mode, so it will take a little bit of time. So I am going to pause the video and uh, after the process is finished, then I will uh, come back. So now guys, the device has been uh, recovered successfully and uh, I have connected it to my display unit. So let's go to the display unit. So now guys my STB is on uh, recovering process and this is the display when you connect your STB to your TV or LED. So now the process has been finished and it has took almost 5 to 6 minutes and the display has came after rebooting of STB. So now what you will have to do you will have to go to your menu and it is very essential whenever you update your stb or recover it then you must have to factory default your stb now we will go to we will have open our menu and uh, we will go to dvb setting and we will go to factory update and select the factory reset and then select all yes so it will reboot and uh, after that rebooting of process you have to pair your remote and uh, then you can enjoy all of your feature so I uh, hope you guys enjoy the video if you have any curious question you can contact us on our whatsapp number and hope you guys enjoy the video see you in next video with new topic till then take care and bye bye